American the public started moving to the left, to the uh, to the right, to the Republicans, and complaining with all the headlines and on TV about white people are being discriminated against by doing all this stuff for black people. It wasn't enough, but some was too much. What is and now called reverse that, discrimination? That, reverse discrimination. Yes, yes, yeah. right. Doing too much for us. And then after that, we have had, uh, since that time, if you look at the figures on everything that's happened, we jump all the way over to the Democrats since that time. We, black people have been consistent Democratic voters. You know, when they're going to vote, <laughs> they usually in national politics vote for Democrats, local uh, politics too. But we can't always count on them doing what we need. And part of the problem is not that they don't want to. That's not the point. The point is the politics of getting elected and politics of when you are confronted with what you're doing for black people is reverse discrimination. So now we fat fast forward to what has happened to us in the last few years. You've got open, open conservative politics talking again about reverse discrimination and DEI. And black people are only up there because they don't ever say Clarence Thomas is up there because of DEI, but he is. You know, if you want to say that he's up there because he's black, because I know that when they picked him, they wanted a black face in high places. Uh, but all of that has happened to us. The book banning, the attacks on critical race theory, the attacks on teaching uh, Nicole Hannah Jones and 1619 Project, and even teaching anything about black people, or even talking about our problems. And the courts, the courts, even though Biden has appointed a lot of federal judges, and we are happy to have a lot of them actually get in there, you cannot in the Court of Appeals and Supreme Court when you confront it. And then we see what happened when we got the North Carolina and the Harvard cases. Some people were surprised. How did this happen? They hadn't been following <laughs> what was going on. I don't see that. And so now we have a situation where black farmers cannot get their money, even though they've been fighting for years about the discrimination against them. And I helped them when I was at the commission. I helped to get a report on their crisis, which they used in court. And they still can't get it. Why? It's reverse discrimination against white farmers who didn't have anything bad happen to them. The forgotten part of my fellow citizens. It is strong. It's my duty to report the true problems of our nation. We vigorously developed this resource to be of great benefit. Where diverse nations are drawn together in common cause. I will be eternally grateful for your support.